break her back, knee deep in, put my leg in it. After we fuck, ain't no land up, gotta let my man hit it. Two the coop, poppin' that bitch, drop the roof, I'm stand up in it. Fight time I get for the rest, I'm dropping all that shit at the dealin'. But near me, bitch, it's only me and my niggas, you cannot stand near me, bitch. Yeah, we really rich, keep them bitches on tuck up, a nigga act up, I bet he get hit. And we with the shit, pullin' up in all type of different shit. Got these bitches on go, bet they fuck up with but I bet she do anything for the dick. Get in that bag, fuck up, I should find nigga. We do not fuck with no lame nigga. Please don't say nothing to the gang nigga. Could I pull up and take your chain nigga? Her, she fine. I'ma have to fuck one time. Get in her spine. He'll drop the whole dime. Nigga can't fuck with your kind. I'm do no line. All my niggas, solid bitch. Both of my guns got bodies, bitch. Uh, I had to hide them bitch. Bet they won't find them bitch. Caught me a flight to a whole different kind of city. Swear that the time is different. Nothing and go back and forth with a nigga by shit. Put this dick in her mouth, let her swallow my jit. And we not pulling up if that money ain't ready. Walking through the back, counting for you collect. Cause we need all that, all that. Money stacked up like midges on top of each other. No tall rat, tall rat. I don't wanna fish you with you. Fuck out my back, nigga. Fall back, fall back. You don't suck dick when we fuck. You can lose my number. Don't call back, call back, yeah. I'ma break her back. Knee deep in it. Put my leg in it. How do we fuck? Ain't no land up. Gotta let my man hit it. Hoppin' that bitch, drop the roof, I'm standin' up in it Right time I get for the rest, I'm dropping all that shit at the dealin' But near me, bitch, it's only me and my niggas, you cannot stand near me, bitch Yeah, we really rich, keep them bitches on tuck up, a nigga act up, I bet he get hit And we with the shit, pullin' up in all type of different shit Got these bitches on go, bet they fuck up whatever, I bet she do anything for the dick Swear, hold on, little hoe, bitch, you can't get with me I here fuckin' for the rest, you ain't trickin' me, I ain't goin' for it Bitch, I can't fall for that, you knew what it was, you know you with all of that, yeah Stop trying to act, let a nigga get in that back Not the tight, the cuff on the neck Bitch, you gotta throw that shit back Let the gang hit, little bit. don't be stingy with the cat Run all the rest and get plenty more We got them big fat blue hunter, they got kind of fit in that video Bitch, you a silly hoe, fuck with them bad bitches and some diddy hoe Every clip in these scuffs is a stilly hoe Fuck with the gang, bet we shoot this bitch like a video Run up the rest and get many more, plenty more Ice on my neck and my wrist, I want ten of those I really stand down ten toe Gotta keep shit solid, don't fold Stack that, flip that, triple though Ain't no option, gotta bring that money home Fuck the pen and bitch, I stand for the principle. Play with this shit, I bet it can get physical. Trigger on the AK-9 and it's sensitive. If I hit these bitches, sound like a musical. I'm trying to nut in a pretty bitch pivot. If I cuff a bitch, she gotta be some type of doctor. Cause I be needing pharmaceuticals, eh? I'ma break her back, knee deep in it. Put my leg in it. How do we fuck? I ain't no land up. Gotta let my man hit it. Two up cool, hopping that bitch, drop the roof. I'm standing up in it. Right time I get for the rest, I'm dropping all that shit at the dealing. But near me, bitch. It's only me and my niggas, you cannot stand near me, bitch. Yeah, we really rich. Keep them bitches on tuck up, a nigga act up, I bet he get hit. And we with the shit, pulling up in all type of different shit. Got these bitches on go, bet they fuck up whatever, I bet she do anything for the dick. Swear. I just had to play the block. Stick on me, leave it bleeding out. We job loops that you niggas dream about. You really want me come see what the team about? Uh, it's some shit on me. Everybody back, back, it's some shit on me. Uh, it's some shit on me. Tell these niggas back, back, it's some shit on me. Uh, it's some shit on me. Everybody back, back, it's some shit on me. Uh, it's some shit on me. Tell these niggas. Back, back, get some shit on me. Uh, 200k to roll, bounce some shit on me. Don't let him reach, we'll terrorize his big homie. Magic stick on him, caught him at the ribs hugging. Humpty Dumpty, you know I had to slump him. How he fell off the wall, this shit was ugly. Take the lease off the bitch, I know you love her. She talking down on me to you, cause we full. Pockets husky, you know I'm finna dub her. Dumb bitch, don't want no Instagram lover. Never will I trust her, I'm geeking off her upper. Make love in your cousin's RG bunker. Never will I trust her. I'm geeking off her upper. Dumb bitch, don't want no Instagram lover. Pockets husky, you know I'm finna dub her. Never will I trust her. I'm geeking off her upper. Make love in your cousin's RG bunker. Uh, so you can use this to make the 
Everybody back, back, get some shit on me, uh. Get some shit on me. Tell these niggas back, back, get some shit on me, uh. Get some shit on me. Everybody back, back, get some shit on me, uh. Get some shit on me. Tell these niggas back, back, get some shit on me, stick on me. He must stick, he finna blitz on me, shit talking. Mr. Rich Barker, he a disc jockey. Remember me, I'm this poppin'. This a double R, this is not that other car. Ain't no mind in yours. I'm getting kinda bored. Uh -huh. How you send me? I just look like I'll be buying more. Uh -huh. Stick tricky. Any of you just come to the HQ? Pippy, Pippy, I'll put it what? in the city. No, I got her still. I'm slapping on a Jimmy. Got a black. Did you just come to the HQ? Nowhere else. I got a blast. I left her in a Somebody ran through the gate, but I couldn't tell who it was. Some shit on me. Everybody back, back. Oh, now I can. Oh, Tony, you're in city? Perfect. Get some shit on me. Are you are you at HQ? Alright, I'll probably be there in a second. Get some shit on me. Everybody back, back. Yeah, that was me. I had the 15 rounds and the 16 rounds. Some shit on me. Tell these niggas back, back. Get some shit on me. Waste your durability like that? They adjusted the durability. Also, and just saying, good, if they make a gunsmith as a civ job, you can thank me. Yeah, civ only job, no gang members. Tony, where are <laughs> oh, you gave it away. You used your mic. You were just supposed to it's talk. Fine, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, the, hair the hair gives it away. The hair gives it away. Yeah, I told him I'd dress up uh, as Irish free disguise, but then we went with this. Yeah, this is a funny And it looks scary, too. Like, just imagine, like, you meet me and I'm looking like this, you know? And then, like. It's ominous as shit just standing here. <laughs> this is terrifying. <laughs> it only looks like he's about to get murdered. What the fuck? <laughs> Tony, you better clip this shit, dude. This is Irish. Yeah, come on down to Chop 6. Yeah, come on down to Chop 6. Chop 6? <laughs> Get your shit straight, Tate. Go ahead for Irish. I'm so excited. Alright, so, um... Did I tell you about the, uh... The blue situation? Yeah, yeah, definitely, because you were there when I went out. Oh, how we think blue's involved with this now? Because, uh, one of the guys the hall was rolling around with, trying to catch me with his blue. Also, I may have pissed off some blues at, at a motel parking lot. You're welcome. Yeah, dude, dude rolls up to me. He's like, hey, you want to roll dice? I was like, nah, dude, I'm good. I know you guys would roll with that shit. Oh, I made it on the news too. And I told I told him the, I told him to buzz off, and like he started getting a little angry. So I was like, dude, and they, they started like, oh yeah, I remember who you guys. We rolled on you guys twice and wiped you guys. And I was just like, yeah. Do you guys even know why you did that? And they like kind of knew, but they didn't know that the guy wasn't in colors, and they didn't know that Carly killed him or took him down because he was being a piece of shit. So they're just rolling on people without even knowing what the full story. They're is. Neanderthals, man. What do you expect? And on top of that, what? Um... One grunt, they all oh, yeah, jump like... on the fucking bison. And he was like, yeah, how do you remember that we rolled on you twice? Like, because I didn't see the light, dumbass. Don't you guys remember that you got arrested the second time? And your boy combat logged? So, I got into him a little bit, but I mean, it's in a green zone. They're not supposed to take green zone arguments uh, for beef anymore. Oh, yeah, yeah. Clear my clip. I'm sorry, Tony. But, but they might be it. angry and they might start looking for stuff. Wait, hold up. What's that? What was that emote that you were just doing? <clears throat> Whoever was kneeling down. I don't even know who that is. And then praying. 
Oh, what is that? Yeah, look at that. God, <laughs> what is that? What is that? What is that? Is that surrender and like pray or Nam something? Namaste. Namaste. <laughs> like that. I think it looks fucking killer with the fucking. Uh... Whoa, Tony, what are you doing, <laughs> bro? Yeah, let's go I'll get in the backyard and, like, in a circle, do that. <laughs> let's go. Yes. Alright, what is it? It's surrender See, I... and what else? Did I not say black and white for the new uniforms? It actually looks kind of good. Namaste. Namaste. Tony, can you take a picture of this? Did you get the damn picture, Tony? Stop pointing the gun at me. Shots fired. But it's like fish in a barrel right now. <laughs> yeah, I know, but it looks badass as fuck. <laughs> Crazy, I can one-tap Tony right now <laughs> if I wanted to. Yeah, that's how you end up in a grave. <laughs> I know. <laughs> What was I gonna say? Um, I know Sips has um, some contact with Blue. I don't know if it's one or two I wanna, Blue individuals. I want to. I want to. I have a, a contact with the Blanco. I want. I want to go through with this Paul Sean lead, or Sean Paul lead first before we uh, go anything with Blues. Where y'all going? I don't know. I'm gonna fucking drive around. Sean Paul is in the city. Yeah, yeah, he's, he called me earlier on an anonymous line. I was like, what do you think? He was like trying to meet me up for like upgrades. I was like, what do you think? I'm stupid. Oh, nice. Hold on, wait. Yeah, I have it. I have his number and Tony has his number. Yeah, so he was trying to collect on it at shop one and they ended up getting to it. Like other mechanics ended up getting into a shootout about it. Don't break my windows, please. Yeah, he's trying to collect. Are you, I'm trying are to you having a conversation problem. in the car? Because we're only yeah, here yeah. Like, I'm talking to him in the car. I'm not talking on cons. Sorry. I was just asking him. I I thought Sean Paul was the guy who put the hit out on him, but he was the one trying to collect the hit. So we're gonna go try and find him and get information out of him. True. I'm gonna call Brody and have him meet me at like shop six or something. How's everyone's day going in car two? Shop on, boys. The hell?
Yo, y'all look really fucking cool, man. Wait, is that him right there? Oh, you in the blue? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bro, who is that? Uh, well, I mean, yeah, you had a hit on where you were going after Irish. Oh, shit. You know, it only, you know, makes sense that they all were after you. Well, yeah. it came at the right time. You asked yeah. me to set them up. Holy fuck, that's a lot of people. I just kidnapped like him. Like, a hit on him? They look like they're straight out of Call of Duty. What's going on here? Who are these guys? Uh, okay, so, uh, so... What's happening, this? Sean Paul. What's going on? Uh, What's up? Holy shit. I like the face mask. Okay, so yeah, you like that? <laughs> Friggin' right. It's pretty scary. Yeah, well, uh... Our boy Irish has a hit on him right now, so... Irish has a hit on him? <laughs> yeah. Wait, wasn't he with us? Who put a hit on Irish? No, 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 that's the That's actual... Um. They're, they have a guy named Irish. Bro, I'm confused. We have yeah. a guy named Irish. <laughs> hey, you fucking dumbass. Not right now. Our Irish is nothing like their Irish, yeah. though. Apparently, some pizza boy named Sean Paul is uh, trying to collect a hit or some shit. On Irish? <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> yeah, dude. How much is the bounty? I have no idea. Oh, and is he gonna have to give him back the diving, uh, skydiving job? Probably not I much. I don't imagine. Right, when the fuck did you go to jail, bro? Bro, when I did a robbery with Black Widows, dude. They didn't I give you a job back this morning? No. I thought I did. I swear to God, I did. No, no, no. What the fuck, I was, Ron? I still had the job, and then after I start, I stopped uh, when we jumped off the fucking maze bank, the and then after guy? that, I went to, to the robbery with them. Who's this guy? It's Patrick. Ron. Oh, is that Ron? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it was good, Ron. Bro, it looked like half Black Widow and fucking half fucking cartel. <laughs> What's a gun? Where the fuck? I'm. Fu can I fucking kill that guy? He's annoying. That's um, that's Max's brother. I know. That's Max's care. brother, Austin. Yeah. No one away. Oh, what's what's the fucking creep? Uh, oh, uh, creeps. Uh, that what's was easy. Called? Reindeer, are you okay? So what's good, Nizzy? Not much, my boy. No? Yeah. Get into some fun just... shit yesterday or what? Uh, what did we do yesterday? I forget the fuck we did yesterday. Yesterday, bro. we did the party at Max's place. We, we didn't even do anything, did we? No, no, no? not really. It's all uh, a yeah, cop helicopter shit. over by the penitentiary. Oh. Oh yeah, yeah. I fucking right. had a. Uh, I had my guy. Uh, my, one of my guys went to jail, so I kidnapped the cop, and I had them release my guy from jail. Oh, <laughs> really? Fuck yeah, buddy. Yeah, yeah. Miata, Miata went to jail, so I had to get him out. Yeah, and he, he didn't gave get me a me call. <laughs> he told me he had like. When the fuck were you in jail? <laughs> Motherfucker, my hat. Oh, that's son of a. No, 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 no. Gotta hate it when your boys knock your hat off. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Attitude. He didn't. Oh shit, reindeer, are you okay? <laughs> Isaac. <laughs> oh, okay. Wait, wait, wait. You look like some badass motherfuckers. I want. Oh shit! He's gonna say, "Here's me." I apologize to him. There he is. Oh shit! Hello, do you hear me? What's up? Hey, can I? Uh, are you Irish? Me? Yeah. I need to talk to him. Oh yeah, who are you? Uh, I made a mistake yesterday, and I want to talk to whoever Irish is. You can talk to me. I want to apologize to Irish about my actions. Because I was apparently setting up something, but I mean, and I regret it. And I just, I'm deciding to change myself. All right. Are you... And I want to, I want to know who Irish is because I want, or I don't even have to. You don't even have to. But he, I called Taz and he told me to just, because I, I, I put Taz up to gunpoint by accident. Well, not by, I mean it was by accident because, but like at the time I was like I wasn't thinking. Yeah. And you know I'm deciding I don't want no more enemies here. Yeah, I mean that's and usually I wanna, the I best plan of action, up. you know. <laughs> Cause I had the whole uh, red team after me, me apparently. Why is this 
ass showing. I don't want to see that. Yeah, I mean, Irish is one of my boys, and you don't want to be fucking with any of my boys. Yeah, no, no, no. Is, is it okay if I just apologize to him firsthand? Sure, yeah, just apologize like, to all these guys right here. Yeah, you apologize to one, you gotta apologize to the other ones, you know? Yeah, they're all Irish, you just apologize to all of them. Hey guys, I I just wanted to let you know. <laughs> He's probably, look, there's, one has his gun I mean, He's probably terrified of that one right there. All I mean, of you. His first mistake was when he took the Yeah, do you know which one's the real one? Uh, I do okay. not. You're gonna I, have I can't well, watch. well, well. Because it's not a bunch of fedoras. These aren't even fedoras, bro. They're fedoras. I don't They're bowler hats. They're bowler hats, you dumbass. <laughs> what? Jump them, boys. Get out of here, Dizzy. Jump him, jump uh, Okay. Don't hit me. Hit the. Get on the gun Dizzy down. just ruined the whole fucking thing. God what damn it. Who's that? Someone grab him. Someone grab him. Someone grab him. What's happening? Did I get stabbed? I got stabbed. Ah. All right, Nizzy, chill, 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 chill. It's a green zone. <laughs> the fuck? Oh, what's up, bro? Sorry, Tony. Uh, hey, hey, hey. hey, hey, hey bro, if I get hit one more time, I'm shooting, bro. On God, I'm chill. shooting. Oh, God. Chill. Stop, stop, stop. What the fuck are they doing? Oh, God. Jesus Christ. Why is it so What's he? Bro, Nizzy, they were literally in the middle of the scene, bro. Yeah. What seed? Dude, that guy that was talking to us in the hoodie was trying to do a hit on me. Wait, what guy in the hoodie? You guys all look the same. That's the point. That's the point. Wait, I'm so confused. The guy that wait, the guy that wanted to kill you guys wanted to kill me. Yeah. Irish. And you guys are dressed up like him? No, just as Irish. Yes. Oh, this guy over there in wait. the red and white sweater over there. I was the only one that kept my bullet. He is my hair, fucker. I'm so confused. Just refresh yeah, skin. Oh, refresh that skin. Guy? Yeah. Oh. Who was? Who? 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 who, who oh yeah, it is Jean Paul. Dude, like you say, Carlo. Who was born first? I said Jean Paul. I said Jean Paul. You fucking idiot. I need. A, I need to go to pill box. No, but 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 when were you born? Uh, does anybody need bandages? Ouch. Okay, who said that? Who said that? Who said that? I need someone. Okay. Oh, I'm right here. Well, that's uh, over. Mm. Yeah, can I get some, please? Yeah. Uh, 1998, you motherfucker. Oh, so May 14th, 1998. I'll show you my ID, oh, you dumb bitch. Man. My hair, motherfucker. I'm actually kind of mad now. Why'd you do that, man? Why'd you do that, Drake? Why'd you? Ouch! Yeah. Why'd you do that, Drake? Here you go, Drake. Are you signing on PD or some shit? Oh shit, the cops? No. What the fuck? Yeah. Back oh, at it again. Mr. Sir, can you handcuff me, please? Nice to meet you, too. Nice to meet you, too. Oh, now my hair's messed up. The hole's up and we're short of what? And what? We're short of what? We're short of car. Oh, is it gone? Because there's a wipe. Oh. Where is my stepper? Which one is it? Not that one, it's the lower one. <laughs> Who pulled out the other Stafford? Oh, oh, hi. Yeah, uh, yeah mine. We, are, we are twins. We're just not getting twins. Alright, no, this, this is yours. Mine's over at the uh, house. Yeah, that's a really fucking nice man. Don't talk, to my, don't talk to my fucking brother like that. About my brother, man. Okay. Are we leaving? Oh. Yeah, what are we doing? Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. You, you I'll wait. You can come back and get me. Yeah, I can wait too. Whoever's car this is, hop in. Oh god. I need to go to pillbox. Yeah, do you need Ben? <laughs> Whose oh, car is this? Let's go. Spray painted waves. Ouch! Let me go, man. Let me fucking go. Whose car is this? Not Ow. mine. Whose car is this? Get in the car. Let's go grab another one, and then let's get out of here. 
Hey, honestly, I thought you guys were Yo, just taking anybody a picture. on cons, bro? No, Whose car no, is no, this, bro? Who drove the second My Stafford? Bad. I took yeah, one out. Who drove the other one? Let's go cool. cool. start a fight. I took so the other one, but this one's not mine. In the red and white. All right, fuck it. Sorry, bro. This is yours, ours. And I thought there was like more reason to it, and so we were like gonna like dig deep and like investigate and shit, and then just like kidnap him and like be like, who who you working for, and shit like that. And then it just turned out he just picked a random person. It just happened to be me. So yeah, what an idiot. It it went from disappointing to like whatever. So. Yeah. Do you guys need Sorry, me to dude. take him to... Yeah, we just counted. We saw six and six, yeah. and we're like, yeah, let's go jump yeah. them. Nah, yeah, what do you mean? These guys dead? No, they're not dead, bro. No, no, no. Please help me. Please help me. I got no. rdm oh. RDM'd. Oh, uh, shit, my bad. I'm sorry. Uh... Okay, I'm good, bro. <laughs> uh... Wait, wait, who... Wait, wait. Who are we leaving? Okay, There's so one more who... okay, we need to get here. another vehicle. The other one defaunted and Carl. Tony, you're really quiet. Just come over here, AJ, with me and Luke, and we'll wait for him to come Thank back. you. I, I like how you Dude, I, my mood is now over here. Well, yeah. I thought oh, I was already oh, fucking out I was about to shoot. Like, I, I mean, I don't know if you. Green zone. Irish. There's another dude in black, and considering most of. You need to. Button? You need to expect that shit when you call somebody like Nizzy a dumbass. Uh, I'm, look, man. This no, is no, 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 no. I'm ridiculous. talking about the, the fact that it was over nothing. Oh, that guy? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's still pretty funny, though. <laughs> and no, no, no. Nizzy, Nizzy was, like, going to jump us anyway. Because he was like, oh, there's six of us and them, and there's six of us. Let's go jump. He thought we were just taking a picture. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but then he's a dumbass. And he's like, oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah. We're going yeah. to pillbox. We're literally dying. I'll be back, Tony. Like, yeah, I'll wait here. Need to put my hat on. I'm gonna fly out. This was fucking stupid. Yeah, I'm kind of annoyed I'm now. I'm about to join you. Nizzy's a fucking cock sucking piece of shit. He thought we were just taking a picture, so he thought it was fine to just fight us like that. But I mean, I did call him a dumbass, but like at the same time, I was like, come on, bro. We're like literally in the middle of something. Yeah, you can expect him to be a dumb piece of shit like that sometimes. Also, every time. What'd Nizzy do this time? They ruined Irish's whole scene. Yeah, we're in a little bit of a scene. We, we found Sean Paul and we were. AJ, hey, we're here. Did you get They're a car? Right? No, I'm, just, I'm gonna walk for a bit and I'm fucking. And Irish was asking for it. Okay. Yeah, so the whole the whole hit situation was literally over nothing. He just kind of picked a random name. Yeah, he didn't even know who and Irish it just was. Happened to be <laughs> me. Well, that's fucking lame. Mm -hmm. It was really funny wanted, though, because like, just like it could have been so cool, and it was just disappointment the whole way down. I'm sorry to hear that, buddy. Also, yeah, yeah. Nizzy is... annoys the fuck out of me. Irish, I'll send you the clip of me talking to him. It's pretty funny. Alright, so what did Nizzy do? Uh, we were at the, um, Los Santos Customs or whatever to meet up with that Sean Paul guy. Um, and then he came over and talked to me. And he's like, are you Irish? And I was like, no. I ruined it though, because okay. uh, I was watching your mouth move yeah, with the cigarette in it. It does. What's up, like, or don't follow me. Wait, what's up? Sorry, no, they what's were talking. Up, oh, I was just telling Vinny what was going on, and then you guys walked up. Oh, sorry. So how did how did Nizzy uh, ruin your scene there? So basically, we us. so uh, the the Sean, or Taz actually got the guy to come to shop one because he wanted to end the conflict. You know, he didn't realize that he picked someone he really shouldn't have picked. Um, because he literally just pulled a name out of a hat and said, "All right, I'm gonna go hunt this guy down." You know, um, and so he pulls up. All six of us are dressed as me: hat, cigarette, mask everything all nine yards it looked awesome uh and we're all lined up on the wall tony's talking to the guy the guy hops up and says hey i just want to say i'm sorry like i wanted to end the conflict and i was like yeah which one of us do you think is the real one he's like i have no idea i said take a guess and then nizzy runs up just and just decides oh look at all these bunch of fedora wearing babies or whatever and i said it's a fucking baller head you asshole and then he just and then he's like oh just jump just call me an asshole just jump just jump him and it's like it's like a fist fight, and I was like, God damn it. Yeah, you called him a dumbass. That's 
But... Yeah, because I'm like irritated because the whole thing that I was like Where hyped over go? for like the whole day, I was like super interested, and it just, you know, ended up being disappointment. Yeah, that sounds like some usual bullshit that you yeah, would pull. Right, right, right. We're all at HQ. Oh shit, you're right there. Hey, what's up there? Yeah, that's, uh, that's fucking dumb. I'm telling you right now, do you have Ben's number? His property, I'm shooting him in the head, and I'm gonna keep shooting him in the head until I run out of ammo. Yeah, cause that's fucking ridiculous, man, like... No, it's fucking not. You guys are overreacting. Fucking somebody calls me a dumbass to my face, I'm gonna rock them in the face, okay? Understand that. Well, You're calling him a fucking a... boss a dumbass to his face. What are you expecting? Well, it sounds like he was acting like a dumbass. He walked up and said, look at all these fedora wearing motherfuckers. Motherfuckers. Yeah. Oh, in the middle okay. of a serious yeah, okay. scene. In the middle it of didn't serious. fucking look like a serious scene, so you can't fucking just be like, oh, this is a piece of shit, let's unload on him. I, I absolutely can. I get that you've got I mean, grievances from your cousin, but you can't bring that over here. I don't give a fuck about my cousin. This isn't about my cousin. I was involved in a cool ass scene. We were having a good time. He wants to come up and start talking about fedora wearing douchebags or some shit, and then we can't call him a dumbass. I'm sorry. Look, you you want to talk shit? Be able to take it back. Otherwise, shut the fuck up as El Jefe. <laughs> I mean, this isn't the first time that he's interrupted a scene. It just seems like he thinks he can do whatever he wants. And it's kind of annoying to come in and hear that he does it again. It just would have been better if he wasn't there. Bro, he kept punching sure. me, bro. Like it's a green zone. He's supposed to do that shit. No. Rollo rolled, all rolled no. up and started punching people, which is even dumber. Oh, like, that's annoying as fuck, bro. Okay. Anyways, yeah. it's ruined and done. So that's why you now. don't have a fucking scene in a fucking crowded place full of people that are bored. Well, it was unfortunately just we happened to walk right up on Taz as he was uh, on the phone with that individual. Am, am I still there? Sorry, I I had a brain fart. Yeah, we You're can good. hear you. Okay, yeah, no, it's just yeah, we man, literally walked up. Down. We weren't we weren't planning on doing it there. We went to see Taz to get information on him. Taz literally on the phone with him, and then they were talking about this very. And I come down to shop one right now and squash it. So. Yeah. This man has a stripe on his pants. And then what? Yeah. What the happened when Nizzy him. found out he ruined a scene? Uh, I. Honestly, I don't even know. He, he fucking, fucking apologized. Cost. No, he fucking apologized. He didn't know because it didn't look like a fucking scene. It looked like we were taking a fucking picture. Uh, fair enough. I'm just saying, we can't just be fucking so hot-headed. That's their job. <laughs> well, I mean, I was close I to mean, dying, people just... so if I'm close to dying and I'm still getting hit, I think I have the option to shoot them. Um, also, the, it's just kind of stupid. I mean, so stupid is, stupid does, right? That's that's why one person starts that. Yeah, let's, shoot, let's be the shoot. bigger person. I'll be back. I mean, change. it's fucking green zone, so yeah, nobody yes. was dying, but it just ruined Irish's scene, that's all. I know, but there's there was a fucking scene before that none of y'all got to hear. Which also probably ruined Irish's scene quite a bit, too, but... I mean, I think I was shouting, but the other guy, he definitely was No, we couldn't hear anything you were saying. Oh, okay. Well, it was fucking funny as shit. Yeah, I believe you. I'm sure it was fucking him shaking in his boots or whatever. Pretty much. And, and yeah, it was pretty funny because, like, he's like, I just really want to apologize to Irish. And I was like, okay, well, they're all Irish. You can go apologize to all of them. <laughs> so he went and apologized to each of you individually. <laughs> started to well he was he should have been on shout and then he would have been able to fucking do it but he doesn't know what he's doing because i could barely hear him your face fucked up Vinny? yeah this house is Careful, fucked up and my do i have a cigar in my mouth because i don't see it nope why isn't it working also, there's no TVs in the house, and there's no doors. <laughs> yeah, it happens sometimes. We call Don Pancho, get him to install some doors for us. <laughs> He's gonna come here and think you're fucking high as shit, because he's gonna be like, there's doors on every fucking doorway, what the hell? <laughs> Put better you don't door, know, maybe Don? he'll see what I see, I don't know. <laughs>
No, it's still default, Danny. Try a different outfit, Vinny. Oh, I got some oh, green keys. All of them. Here, green. Actually, I'm putting the stash. Yeah, green keys and a uh, Trojan USB. Oh, Tony, what's your uh, favorite number there? I got some stuff for you. Uh, one sec. Uh, 69. Nice. Fine, ignore me then. Fuck you. So I was in the stash. It's okay, I love you. Not much. A little bit though. No payback necessary, man. Oh, you'll get paid back in, uh, in weapons. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. Any plans tonight? Um, I don't know. Let's go figure something out. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna start doing that more. Do we have any aluminum yet, or no? I have some at the house, but it's not enough. Yeah. So I'm just I'm just saving it up. Yeah, I want to see if I maybe we can buy some. Buy some material. Yeah. Well, fucking aluminum is just it, like we need it. Yeah. Need more cuffs. Everybody should have a pair. I gave my cuffs away, but then he lost it. Yeah, that's what happened to my last three pairs. <laughs> Damn. Shit, so what are we doing today? I was just asking. Wasn't in color. They didn't know that the guy uh, was also taken down by Carly. And they also didn't even. I, I should have said this there, but I was like. They don't even realize that I helped one of their guys, you know, when their HQ was getting hit when they were pretty fresh into the city. I brought one of their guys fast to their HQ to help defend. I made it on the news, too, by the way. Yeah, the crip walking. What? Did you? Yeah, I said, I don't know if I... it'll be on the news. I said, can I be on the news? And I did this. <laughs> Damn. All right, boys, what do you think we should do? Oh, wait, Tony, did you get that, that picture from earlier? Which one? The one of us in the circle? Yeah. Oh, dude, that, dude you gotta send that. Yeah, I will. Um, Who's got Ben's number? Ben. Owner of the nightclub, Ben. Mm, I don't have it. Nope. Not me. <laughs> Never even met the guy. No, he's not around. Uh, He still owes me half a mil. Damn. Whoa. Whoa. You like teleport? Yeah, we're gonna have to go collect on that. Yeah, it's not joking. Oh. Yeah, no doubt. Dude, whoever, whichever one of you guys discovered this shit, this shit is badass and I love it. It was me. Randy, I love you. It's it's a pretty badass. Next problem. time next time I'm like about to kill you, just remember just remind me that you showed me this and you'll get one free. Pray for ass. your life. Okay, sweet. <laughs> Pray for your life, Randy. I'll just start. I'll start doing it. No, when no, you, it's, when it's you like, say you're gonna kill me, and you'd be like, "Oh, that's right. Okay, get off here." Yeah, exactly. You get you get one. You get one free Irish pass. One free get out of Irish free card. Where do I get but the get like, into Irish free card? Dude, it feels like I'm like. <laughs> it, dude, it feels like I'm like blessing my gun before I kill somebody. Well, what's the plan, boss? Like. We just chilling. Uh, um, what do we? Yeah, we yeah. are low on a certain acid, correct? Yeah, we could go grinding for a little bit. So we'll do some acid then. I'm gonna check on the. Uh, acid. I, I personally oh, want to yes. check on the. Um, Let's go collect the Sorry. location yes. to see if it was moved yet. I know it wasn't, but I want to anyway. I mean, it's right there, so might as well. Yeah, true. Yeah, right. yeah um, I don't. We have bottles. Fuck, yeah, we're low should. on that acid. We just. Fucking picked up 500 bottles we're low the other day. Yeah, dude, we're always low on it. The more you can get, the more we can make. Yeah, we lost 100. I know how making acid works. Meth, I mean. <laughs> did Did Drake go take anything from our stash? No, no, no. no. Anything. He left some shit in there. Yeah. I think. Oh, okay, good. Yep. Yeah. And then I I, I like made Draco. sure. Yeah, I know. Me why too. Did, why did he have to? 
I don't know. Hack. It made it made makes so much sense now that we know. It makes though. sense now. Yeah, it does. He had so much fucking money. Yeah, dude. He had all the guns and shit. Like every time what? he came over, he was like, I, I just I just bottles. came from the casino. I won this much that's, money. That's going to grind but now I know that that's um, empty bottles. Not empty ass bottles. Empty bottles. Clearly. Um. How we many empty bottles we got? Hang on, we need 300, we're 300 down on one specific. AJ flew out. Uh, I don't know, maybe. Yeah, we're 300 yeah, down, did. 100 chloric. Yeah, he's bored with us, I think, to be honest. Because we don't really have Says he's to still do in yet. town. Yeah, he said he's going to go for a walk and then he's going to fly out. Probably going to hop on Casper, I guess. Or let us, let us Can I empty my him. clip? Because, like, I don't want low clips in my shit. Empty it right before we leave. Copy. Hey, uh, little brain fart here. They got it's the uh, just the empty bottles, right? Not the acid. Yeah, ones? just just the empty bottles, not the acid ones. Right. Acid bottles are for yeah. the island, right? And we need acid bottles are for LSD. Acid. Right. Where are you, Iron? Oh, there. Um, right here. You just spying on Vinny through the window? No, I'm just fucking moving around like a dumbass. Oh, okay. Uh, we need 300 more hydrochloric than we do uh, phosphorus. I don't know if AJ is still on comms or not, but he's not. I'm pretty sure you know a lot of his grievances are bleeding through. What do you mean bleeding through? From his cousin to his himself. What do you mean? I mean his issue with Nizzy. Oh yeah, yeah. Randy too, probably. So I don't know if I'm allowed to say this, but since he's not with us anymore, I don't think Nate ever wanted to be with us. Nope, I could tell you that from the start. Yeah. He was not just fit for here, he just wanted a group to be with. He kept messaging me that, you know. Yeah, like, fucking, don't, if you don't want to be with us, you should have done it before you became a soldier. That's what I'm saying, like. You, you get, do we, do we tell them when they're a soldier, right? Like, you can't, like, you become a soldier, you can't leave. Yeah, that's right? what I was told when I got promoted. Like once, once, once I was, once I got promoted, he was like, "This, you can't leave anymore unless you want to get killed." We didn't say it like that, but <laughs> yeah. Yeah. you get, the point. You get the point. When, yeah, once yeah. you become a soldier, if you want to leave, you get whacked. Yeah. You leave, you, if you want to leave, you leave in a body bag. You guys already take off? Not yet. We're just out back. I'm gonna take my Zentorno since it's got a hundred and some trunk space or some bullshit. Nice. The fuck? <laughs> yeah, it's disgusting. It doesn't even have a trunk. I can't even open it. Yeah, how does a Zentorno have 120, but... Right. It's a it's got... And trucks, like my, my, my Pikachu, right, well, which is a truck, has are. 25, I think. <laughs> what, what's the plan? We're gonna go farm some acid for a little bit. Yeah, which one? Uh, we, need, we need hydrochloric. We need basically... 300 more hydrochloric than we do phosphorus. So if we've got four people hydrochloric, we need one person of phosphorus. Sulfuric, you mean? Or, no. Phosphoric. Yeah, sulfuric. Hang on, hang on, I'm gonna go look. I'll just hydrochloric go sulfuric. and sulfuric are the where two you? that we need for. Uh... Where are you going? Stop, what are you... Stop walking behind me. You want to talk? Where are you going? <laughs> where are you going? What do you mean, where, where I'm going? going? Where are you going? <laughs> I'm fucking standing right here. You're the only one moving it. <laughs> Good at the circle stuff. Yeah, yeah so we need 300 hydrochloric. Oh, we're doing we... the circle stuff? After we hit that three, like, once, Definitely if we have three square. people in hydrochloric, because everyone should have 100 Whoa. bottles. If we have three people in hydrochloric, then we need uh, one person on phosphorus and then uh, one person on hydrochloric. And what you pointing that at, motherfucker? Okay, so four in <laughs> hydrochloric and one in sulfur. <laughs> if, if we've got five people, yes. Is this I mean, we got ground? six people. Oh I'll add the sulfuric right now. No, the spider. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna head up to um, hydrochloric right now. I need to go get right. bottles. You can hold about a hundred, uh, give or take. So who's going with who? Wait. Doesn't matter to me. Hey, I'm pretty sure you've got like a man crush on me or something. Yeah. yeah, yeah. 
I'll be feeling my man, Tay. I mean, Adam was trying to steal you from me. <clears throat> yeah. He true. still is. He wishes me he was close to you as he was to me. I think our cousins are close. Yeah, your cousins are, but not us. Who's still in the house? Me, I gotta clear out a little inventory space. You gotta go ahead, I'll catch up. Each bottle weighs one, so as long as you have less than 20, you're fine. Yeah, I got 30. That's why I can clear off some space. I've also gotta take into account the uh, the weight of the actual bottles, like the empty bottles. Yeah, they're basically nothing. Like, uh, yeah. You're good. As long as you have 20 uh, weight on you, you're okay. Where's Vinny? I'm over at Sulfuric now. You guys want us to grab bottles? You already got some. Some in the stash. Just grab a hundred if you can. If there's not enough, then just go to the convenience store. Who gave me a hundred empty bottles? I didn't realize. Uh-oh. Crash.
I popped. I had to. I met motels. Looks like we lost another member too. What do you mean we lost another member as in they popped or? Nope. I think uh, we're not going to be seeing AJ anymore. He's right here. Right where? That fuss work. AJ is? Yeah, but I'm having a massive headache. Yeah, I just had it too. Yeah, I just had to. I just flew back. You trying to roll, bro? It's not gonna crash here. Nah, man. This is just a headache. It's been happening recently. Oh. Well, I don't know. AJ left the Discordio, so I was just assuming. Had this fucking you left the bro. Discordia, but he's standing next to Irish? Hang on, hang on, let me let me talk to him. Yeah, figure that out. Um, there's a dead guy on the road over here. Is it civilian or is it? No, nope, no. Nope. He's just laying on the road over here. Should I take him to the pillbox? 
Um, is he wearing colors? Nope. I guess going. so. Did you call EMS yet, guy? Uh, I don't know. Maybe he's useful. Who knows? See the point in doing it. Well, the only point would just be like a potential recruit, right? Hey, guy, like, do, you, do you know how to do uh, slash me? Not chilling with the group? I don't know. Did you already yeah, we're gonna contact EMS? We need to start what? recruiting people that are experienced. I just think that you have it. All right. Us. You're definitely right, dude. The hard part about recruiting people who are experienced is usually they're already snatched up. It's not just like people just like who are shooters and drivers that are just kind of like pissing around somewhere. Yeah, usually okay. already in a gang. Where are you, Vinny? I'm right here. Uh, here, I'm gonna come take a look at this. Oh, there you are. I don't think I can exactly take him on my bike, you know? Yeah, for sure. Here, I'll give you the keys. Shots fired. Hey. There you go. Thank you. Can you give me the keys to your bike in case I need to, to bolt? Uh, 89. Just letting y'all know I just heard shots, so just be careful. Over at the other acid? Yeah. Alright, stay safe. Hey, what up, babies? What's up? What's good today? Just farming a little acid? Trying to get that money right, Sip. So. Well, I'm glad that we were talking about how gang activity, uh, you know, and the guns and shit. And Jax is over here shooting a sports car at motel parking with a machine gun while Rolo and a bunch of blues watch and shoot their AKs. Good talk. Yeah, no <laughs> kidding. Hello? Yo, you guys really are hidden. I'm trying to find you guys to meet up. I was trying to find the house. This is a uh, Mick. Uh, Mick. You guys should Mick, go up and tell uh, them that they're encouraging me and that they're trying the, to uh, that they're the encouraging me to super engage cool in gang war. Jacket with the awesome. Do oh, it. Fuck. I mean, the mustache beard. Oh, deal. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where you at? Where you at? So stupid. The motel. I'm a motel with my lawyer. I just got out of jail. I was trying to ask for directions. These motherfuckers got me, bro. On an illegal lane change. Are you serious? <laughs> Jesus. Do you need some? Um, I'm just heading back to town right now. I just found a guy on the road that I'm taking a yeah, pillbox, sure. but I can come you can, pick uh, you up after. You can come see me. It's awesome. Here. Here. I'm, uh, I'm chilling up here. the motel sauce, or motel parking. All right, I'll see you there in a minute. All right, road cheers. Yeah. Do you want me, uh, Do you want me to bring bottles? Uh, yeah. If you can bring like a hundred or something, or however many you can carry. I also don't know where sulfuric is. Should be on the right hand side of your map there. A bit north, it's the purple jerry can. Roger that. Oh shit. We'll get you there, bro. Don't worry. I don't see any EMS, bro. Don't flex it. 
Do you get empty bottles at Toolbox or convenience stores? Convenience stores. Right, we're pretty low in the stash. I'll fix them up. Should be able to check in, bro. Just flex your e muscle. Where are you, Uh, they're not here. <laughs> Obviously. I have Jones. Oh, what's up? Is this Anthony? Yeah. Oh, what's up, bro? Oh, nothing much. I just found some body in the highway, just dropping it off. Oh, okay. Yeah, I kind of just had to kill one of my uh, guys. Oh, really? He was messing with me. Yeah, that guy who I just put in. Yeah. Tried to hit me with a bat, and I got behind him and just karate chopped his neck and killed him. Apparently, oh, fuck you know? yeah, buddy. That's how you do. <laughs> I outplayed him. I went towards a group of people where he wouldn't hit me with a bat because I knew he wouldn't do it. And then I got behind him and just. <laughs> it was so funny. Karate chopped his ass? Yeah, karate chopped, yeah, bro. Buddy. I don't know. It's so. Oh, shh. Listen. Yo, thanks. Hey, for that, bro. Yeah, no problem, bro. Yeah, no. I had a oh. car come out of nowhere. <laughs> Jeez, a uh, car came out of nowhere and just smoked you? Uh, nah, it uh, spawned out of nowhere in front of me, blew out. Oh, okay. Didn't have your seatbelt on or something? I did not. <laughs> yeah, that'll happen. Are you new to the city or what? Uh, I've been here for like a week and a half now. Week and a half? Nice. Yeah, yeah. What's your name? Um, Tony Aaron. Tony Aaron? Yeah. Hey, my name's Tony Russo. Nice to meet you. Oh, sounds, uh, sounds Italian or some shit. Yeah, some shit. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, yeah, I'll let you get back to your business. Aye, uh, you too. How you doing, man? I'm doing good. Yeah? Getting lots of use with that? <laughs> yep, I just beat someone up, you know? I saw you do Jones in, yeah. You guys hear about this Wayne rally or whatever? Nope. Oh. Uh, what's that guy? Dwayne Dez or whatever. I think he got. I don't know. He's either in prison or he got a flight. I guess they're gonna have a protest or some shit at Pillbox tonight. At least that that that's what I heard through the grapevine. Uh, okay. That's doable. Must be an important guy. Meh. So, no. I think his flight must just be controversial, that's all. Not about Wayne Dez necessarily being popular. I didn't really hear about him until he was like popping off in fight night. Oh shit. Tony, where are you guys? Who said sulfuric? Tony was here? Oh, Tony Almost. wants to take you out of the box. I gotta talk to you and Tony at some point. You can come talk to us now if you want. I think yeah, Tony's I'm coming, over, I'm coming over there. I'm, I'm almost there, but I can take a walk if you need privacy. Yeah, a little bit, please. Gotcha. Yeah, I can take a break from this for sure. What the fuck was that song? <laughs> I may be covered in cash. Uh. 
We need to discuss the dirty. What about it? Well, I'm gonna be on a call at some point in the next couple hours here. We need to hash it out, make it work. Alright. What do you need me to do then? I don't know, we just need to talk it over, you know? Figure it out. Oh, you need me to jump in the call? No, I just mean right now. Me, you, and Irish, we can talk it out. Figure mm -hmm. out what what we need to do, right? Alright. So let's just, right. yeah, we can just go over here or something. Sure. Let's go lean on the barrier. Well, that's not the right one. Alright. So, there, there it is. Here's, here's what was explained to me. Okay, and I would appreciate if you both would keep this, like, between us. Like, don't reach out to him, don't reach out to anybody else about it. Uh, AJ's feelings are essentially that he's frustrated with, uh, specifically Tony, you know, constantly bringing up his cousin as reasons as to how AJ feels about stuff, you know? Uh, this this uh, Nizzy situation is, is the, str the straw that broke the camel's back, so to speak, here. He's frustrated because we had like a really cool scene lined up and everything, and then Nizzy comes in, rolls in, and just ruins the whole situation. It's just, and he's frustrated because he has legitimate reasons to dislike Nizzy as AJ, and he got really pissed off when Tony mentioned uh, his cousin as to a reason why he might dislike Nizzy. Hey, that's your uh, staffer. And so, he has told me that his interactions with us as AJ are going to be extremely limited and almost entirely will be when Tony's not around. Jeez. <laughs> That's just what was explained to me. I would really, day. really appreciate it if you guys don't take this to DMs or don't, Late. you know, anything like that. No, I won't. He also... the pink one of the stink, not the wrong way around. I don't know if I'm crossing any lines here, but he told me, or somebody Unless told me, someone dirty, told me, you know? I don't remember who it was exactly, uh, that it was Tony that went into Maki's DM, so it was like, stink all the way bullshitting, down. but... Oh, what up, Sip? Hello. Bullshitting? Yeah, like, saying trashy shit to Maki and... Yeah, I could show you the whole like damn that. thing. <laughs> I mean, personally, honestly, I don't really care, you know? I try my best to keep OOC shit out, and there's a, the reason why I have no cousins is I they wanted zero reason for people to think that I'm like metagaming or anything like that. Yeah. But that's essentially what's going on. Well, he's never mentioned any grievances with Nizzy to me as <sighs> AJ, so. That's that's my issue with the situation is he doesn't like talking to you, Tony. I get it. Like, I don't, I don't know. It's just sort of like he, he hasn't been vocal about a lot of his issues to you guys. You know, when I have a grievance about something, I talk to you guys about it. I make it known. You know? As you should. Whether you, whether you guys go along with my grievances or go against it, like specifically with the Donnie promotion, I was wholeheartedly against that the whole time. And you guys decided to promote it, whatever. I don't really care. You know, and then in my personal opinion, it looks like I should have been right. But I don't care. You know? Yeah, but if we didn't do that, then he wouldn't have gotten permit. Hmm. No, we'd did have to deal with. Did, did he get permit? I'm not entirely. Well, I didn't sure. know they got rid of that. I, yeah, I thought it, they just that was a permanent thing, but. Yeah, but apparently it's back, so that's a thing. Yeah. Um. So yeah. But that was my he thought also, process on that. He also said that basically, he's not gonna essentially allow you guys to uh, whack AJ, so to speak, just based off of the because he's got like a. A recording of basically Tony bringing OOC shit into it. So, um, like what? <laughs> so. You you saying that uh, his cousin is the reason why he doesn't like Nizzy or something like that? I said don't bring your grievances over. Yeah, but that's like I'm just I'm just repeating what I've been told. Okay. Like I said, personally, I don't care. You well, know? I mean, well, uh, last time AJ's not the boss. Time... And he doesn't get to decide what happens to him. Personally, 
I think that AJ should have been like demoted a while ago, I, and I told Vinny this. It's already been never, in the works, but he's never been yeah, around for me to even do it. He's not around ever. He, it feels like he doesn't want to be around, and now I see why, because he just doesn't care for Tony. Your personalities, I guess, clash or some bullshit like that. So, whatever. Yeah, whatever. I don't know. It is what it is. If anything, I personally think it's for the best. He he never really, like, at the start, he kind of felt like he fit in well here, but then the longer it went on, the plus it was just sort of like, what do you do with us? Dude, he never did any crimes. He almost he did almost never any crimes, and the only time he ever went to be was when we were doing scenes like that, where, like, something interesting was going on, which you can't have that all the time. No, that's, that's you know, you it happens when it happens. You're going to have your lows, you know? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, I think everyone in the group kind of understands that, like, if, he, if he's looking for highs, highs all the time, then he should just go join Cartel. Uh -huh. But he doesn't like Nizzy, so. He also obviously doesn't like Nizzy as a person, but that's. He has legit. He, he I already know that. Reasons. Yeah. Honestly, I don't really care for a lot of the shit that Nizzy pulls and the leeway he gets. I didn't realize he lives 10 minutes away from level, so. I didn't know that either. I knew he lived in yeah. the same city. Yeah. Yeah, apparently, apparently he lives like 10 minutes from level, and any time he gets a flight, he just blows net level's phone up or something like that. Yeah. Which is like, come on. Well, his last flight was for flying his helicopter to Crimdog. How was that? Exactly. I don't even understand how that's bannable. That's yeah, the like what? issue. That's, that's what I'm saying. It's like, sometimes he just gets it, because, you know, AJ's not the only person in the city that doesn't like Nizzy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's lots. But the fact that was, AJ is going to say, saying, as soon as Nizzy comes to this property, I'm going to unload my entire gun on him. Um, you know, AJ's not the boss. He doesn't get to decide yeah. when business partners get fucking killed, you know? You know, personally, I'd like to shoot Nizzy, but the problem is I know two things. One, that it's just going to come back around somehow, either through Meadow or whatever. I don't really care. It's going to come back around. Two, it's not my decision to do that, so I don't. Exactly, right? It'll happen eventually, I'm sure. But I don't, you know, I don't want anybody OOC with heart, hurt feelings, right? Mm -hmm. I'd like to go can to I, war with everybody ask, like, <laughs> at some point. <laughs> can, can I just ask, though, like, what, like, what were the stuff that you were saying to Maki in our DMs? Uh, me? Fucking nothing, bro. Yeah. He was, he was saying that, that, he, that she's taking all, everything personally and taking all like OOC. The only I thing I said to her that she may have taken offense to was tell your buddies to go back to 100k or die. That's it. And honestly, everybody else says that. Yeah, I didn't yeah, say anything like nobody else has fucking say, said, right? Yeah, like, I was just explaining to her, I was like, you know, the first thing I said to her was get your cars out of our garage. And then she said, I already did. What's going on? And then I explained the situation. She said she was, wasn't even in the city, didn't even know about it, blah, blah, blah. And I just told her straight up what was going on. Yeah, those are the most disrespectful pieces of shit in this setting, to be honest. Even, like, both OOC and in character. Yeah. I mean, I didn't say anything, like, out of line or anything like that. Yeah. Like, to be yeah. totally honest, I... I wanted to believe that she didn't have anything to do with it, but... Mm -hmm. I don't really believe that so yeah, exactly especially with how much she like dislikes tay she claims that i'll only be pointed at we're not stop, pointing at anybody stop fucking pointing at him all right clear comms though clear comms um but yeah that's that's basically the situation so i think now is probably the best time if ever to bring randy up i think randy definitely deserves to be brought up oh yeah he's got his cousin but he still spends a lot of time he has the security team every fight and i should like that that's been he's... the plan for me and Vinny yeah. have been discussing it for a while especially the whole aj getting demoted thing because you know he seemed really loyal at the beginning and that's why i fucking made you and him capos right away and then he just didn't want to be involved in any any crimes except for uh fucking gathering intel which what has he done uh fuck all like honestly i've gotten more intel personally just by making relationships in the city well you get lots just from being a mechanic that too 
Like, that's that's a really good job to have your ear to the ground. Like, you fucking hear all kinds of shit. Mm-hmm. But, like, I mean, I guess he can't really do his uh, real estate thing right now, but... Yeah, he's just... AJ as a character has nothing to do because he doesn't want to do crime. He doesn't want to grind. He doesn't... No, he wants he to... Doesn't, he yeah. doesn't have a job to work, really, so it's just like, well, what do you do? I don't mind... I don't like grinding, but, I like, if I have to do it, I'll do it, you know? Like, I wanted to make him in charge of the next bank heist. Mm-hmm. Because he never wants to do any fucking crimes. And I think with his perspective, maybe we could actually pull one off, but... Mm-hmm. He never shows any interest in it. To be fair, though, the cops are super... I, I hate the way they handle the bank heists. You know, if I make a demand, no air one, no rapid response or whatever, then there should be permanently, through the whole flight or through, like, a couple-minute timer, no air one, no whatever. I don't care if you have the, the hostages back. Well, that's the thing, right, is he defends everything they do, so if, if, yeah. that, if everything they do is okay, then he should be able to pull one off, right? Mm-hmm. I sure. get his perspective, but everyone else has stuck with us through the slower times, right? Like when the when the money wash was scuffed and, and still is. Like yeah, that. <laughs> when it well, was scuffed, er, yeah. you know what yeah. I mean, bro? Like like everyone else kind of stuck around. Even when, you know, I get it. I get what his feelings are because you know, for his cousin PD's action packed, and then he comes mm-hmm. over here and it's slower. But yeah. it's about getting it on track so that it's not slow for us and you know we need the help to do that like right? my feelings about the whole situation and i know about this a lot but that's just because i honestly want tony to press the level more about it i'm sure you probably do because i don't know the extent of it it's i'm on a call extent. in like an hour or so oh perfect because like we it, still gotta talk about that part too because like it's super frustrating because that's supposed to be our primary income you know Especially it's definitely if- not <laughs> What's up? It's definitely no, yeah, not. It's supposedly it's not. no it's income not. right now. Yeah, it's, it's literally zero. Like, he could probably look at it and see, wow, three people have used it in the last month. Yeah, yeah like, you know? we could pull all of our money out of the boss menu right now, and if we sat for three days and watched it without putting any money in, I bet you would see fuck all. You would mm-hmm. see zero. And yeah. so what really that does me. is it, it, it uh, cripples us in our ability to purchase weapons or do this or do that, which cripples our ability to have beasts with people because we're not prepared. We don't have the money to deal with it and shit like that. It's just... I mean, we've been doing good making money, like... <laughs> with our own shit, you know what I mean? Like Yeah, I know. Like, like Fight Night is huge for us. It That's just sucks that I paid for this source of income that doesn't work, right? Exactly, yeah. And I'm surprised that, like, literally just like, quadruple or ten times the price to be clean. And then, you know, I'm surprised that they didn't up the amount of money you get from drugs as dirty to try to balance it. But I mean, I'm okay with people losing money on Dirty, you know, the introduction of Dirty, just because I think there's too much money in the city anyway. Yeah. Because I mean, I went from being broke ass to having like 800 cars that are like, I'm sitting here like, well, this garage has got way too many cars, so let me do this garage instead, you know? <laughs> that's actually a thought process that goes through my head now. Yeah, that's crazy. You know, like, and on top of that, like, there's so many interactions that having the money wash will bring you. You know, I've like I've literally been building. I haven't touched it in a couple of days. But, like the office, like I want to get that look really nice and shit like that, so that way I can like meet people there and like discuss like the different like processes that go through money laundering and shit like that. Like I've been thinking about this for like weeks, and I haven't been able to do any of them. Yeah. Fucking. Uh, I'm frustrated. Mm-hmm. Randy's not in the city right now, right? No, Randy's in the city. Oh. He's over at. Oh, he's um, at the over at uh, the other one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. He had some a uh, couple complaints, but that was pretty much it. I think like his big complaint was like over the fact that we had like this giant. Or no, actually that was AJ. I don't remember what AJ was complaining about, but it wasn't like anything major. Nothing like AJ was complaining about. Like one of the complaints is how we had this big old beef between like Corleones and how like we're gonna put them down or whatever. And, and it turned out and it just fizzed out but nothing and i was just sitting here like that's because it was all panda and all the beef was bullshit excuse because of panda yeah he's mad that that we're good with them now <laughs> i i guess I yeah Hi, it's, it's, i think he's just a little bit no. like culture shocked bosses are having a meeting so yeah. shh. 
Because that's, that's the thing I explained to Randy when I told him about it, is that, you know, I'm sorry that I, you know, fed it to you like, we're gonna kill these guys and that was the big mission, but it, it was really just about one person. And Vito even expressed to me that on his end, it was Panda who wanted to conduct pretty much everything that had to do with hurting us. So, mm -hmm. yeah, it was... Exactly, so that whole situation yeah. where we got flown to the island, that was 100% being played, I guarantee you. Of course. Yeah, that's the thing, is like, you don't know every side of the story until you know it. Mm -hmm. until, until it finishes. Which is why I get a little fucking, you know, antsy when I have one of my boys going, oh, I'm gonna fucking unload on this guy, fucking da 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 da, -da right? You gotta... I don't need any of my guys starting wars. My issue is my mouth, you know? Especially with like, blues. Like, and it used to be cool, you know, I used to trash talk them. Or not trash talk them, but I used to, like, try to roast them as much as I could, and, like, Twitter or whatever. But I mean, right now it's blues, and I'm probably going to get myself into trouble with blues, but I really just don't care because I'm, I'm tired of, of their bullshit and the stuff that they get away with. And the fact that they think that that 72 hour gang cooldown wasn't to protect them or the five hour one or whatever before that, you know? Yeah. It's literally about to be a 60 v like six. And they think that it wasn't to protect them. Yeah, I mean, that's that's just something you got to expect coming when you're doing shit yeah, like that. Oh, see? I heard from Tony Macaroni. Oh, God. Because we were talking. We're going to have an explosion what? over there. Why? I think that was Sip lighting a cigarette over there or something. Oh, shit. But um, I, I, was, I was talking with Tony Macaroni earlier today, <laughs> and he said that Tuco, who... Fucking Christ. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah like he was talking with um i was talking with tony macaroni and he was saying that he was talking with like tuco who leads blues <laughs> and he's tuco is apparently super cool and super awesome <laughs> the fuck? but then it's like choppa who's the underboss is a huge piece of shit and he was the one that was talking all this shit and during the meeting and it's just like come on I don't know, but it seems like we've got a little bit of recruiting since we lost three people. I actually lost four people and have gained one. Well, Tay's piece of advice there is actually pretty crucial. I just don't know how I would even go about that. What's the advice? The advice is to start recruiting people who, like, aren't new. But it's 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 hard because they're, they're already in a gang. Mm -hmm. That's the issue. You, yeah, I don't want to be you, poaching anybody. No, of course not. I mean, you could try and convince your buddies to, like, make a cousin and, and come hang out, but if they're primary... Yeah, I don't, want, I, don't, I, think, I don't want to do that, though, because then you, you introduce the issues of potential. But... Of course, yeah, I just meant, like, anybody that's actually experienced or whatever, like, most people I meet that are new aren't... They... I don't know. See if Jack wants to make a cousin. <laughs> it's it's not like anybody's going to be like the situation of me where it's like they're new, they're interested, they know what's going on, kind of. They just don't know how to do it, you know? And then they stick around for, what, two months now at this point? Truth be told, I just want a couple of shooters. That's really all it's yeah, about. Like, everyone can kind of drive, right? Like, everyone's mm -hmm. fairly good at driving. I've seen a couple of people who are like, you know familiar with the mechanics of shooting yeah because we're having a really hard time right now practicing we don't get to just chill with angels and have them fucking res us all the time yeah, we have to like... shoot like it's the real deal like fire and then jump into a car and, and leave we don't get time to really dial mm -hmm. down the practice that's why i was like super like excited like, let's do those drive-bys on blues because they're not going to be prepared for it so then we can just open fire done deal yeah yeah, definitely. I don't know, been, man. It would have been a lot more interesting than just going to their HQ and having an all-out fight. Yeah, exactly. Well, that's how we will do it. You know? I don't, not... want, I don't want to do that, though, unless, like, it, unless it's been a built-up thing over months, you know? That's what I'm saying. It's going to be... Not necessarily months, but, like, over a while, you know? Yeah, we're not going to just be like, Oh, you, you stepped on my sneaker. I'm going to fucking kill you. That's pretty much what happened. <laughs> That's pretty much what it felt like happened at fight night, dude. It just felt because, like, I was, when I was talking to those blues and having that discussion, argument, really, that's what it was, they were just like, you're pressing our guys, saying you're going to put a bolt. And instead, I was like, wow, that's crazy. 
was he wearing colors? And they're like, yeah, he was wearing colors. Like, really? Because I'll show you clips. Because he sure shit wasn't wearing colors. He wasn't wearing colors to the point where Carly put him down. One of your own people. And he's like, well, he wasn't fighting. What do you mean he put him down? No, literally, she beat the shit out of him outside of a fight because he's being an annoying piece of shit. Yeah, he was running around tackling everybody and fucking exactly. causing shit. And so it's like, how are we supposed to know? How are we supposed to know to come to you and be like, take care of your boy and get him to stop fucking around him during our event, you know? Yeah, exactly. Nope. If we did that at their event, they'd probably just shoot us. Oh yeah, fucking. Not that they would ever happen. As soon as you walk in, <laughs> welcome to the event. Bang. Yeah, here's the event. Everyone dies. Yeah, super fun. Crips are aggressive. That's just how we are. That's bad RP, is what that is. <laughs> yeah, no doubt. That, that's just that's like the the people. That's like the um. If you guys ever played D and I don't, but I know like this kind of person, the murder hobos. It's just what my character would do. Did you say murder hobos? Yeah, you've never heard of that term? <laughs> no. <laughs> in in D and D, I don't play personally, but I know people who do. Like, if you, if someone's like character that just like literally just goes around murdering like everybody, they it's, it's deemed a murder hobo. Oh my god. They don't do anything other than kill people. Uh yeah, I wouldn't play D and D with anybody like that. <laughs> yeah, their their the excuse is always, well, it's just what my character would do. Mm, yeah, I've heard that. Because he's chaotic, before, yeah. chaotic. <laughs> yeah, he's the chaotic evil or something. Yeah. So, so before before Tony has to jump in this call here, let's get a couple of bullet points for the money wash, mm -hmm. so that he has a, a fresh, fresh plate to go off of. Do you want to do it in a Google Doc where we can all write together? No, but we can do, we can just brainstorm right here so that he has because I know that we all kind of are on the same page about what we want, but we might as well just say it out loud. I love the crypto thing. That's what I love. I like that will take that. time though. Yeah, that'll take time. I just think that they should just sky, like, just put the prices sky high so that way if they want those really awesome, nice weapons, then they have to pay out the ass for it because money's not a problem in this in this place without, unless you're not in a big gang. Honestly, I was kind of bullshitting about the crypto. Like, it was just something I brought up because it was like, I can see where level's coming from about if you just make everything clean money, then everyone's just going to be able to buy fuck ton of weapons off the black market towers. Yeah, that's why you just need to skyrocket the prices until, like, like make them absurdly high to the point where people consider is this really even worth it until you can get a better system in place. Because right now, the system in place is just screwing us. Yeah. What about uh, Panda's idea? What was Panda's idea? Uh, making us control the dirty money so that when people need to buy stuff off the tablet, they have to buy it off us. I mean... I spoke about that earlier with you. But then there's still no washing involved. Yeah, it's like yeah, that's, that's... that defeats half the point. That defeats like. Yeah, exactly. I, th I think that's the, I mean, really the only thing that he can do until the crypto is fucking uh, in the city is make Jack skyrocket the prices. Or they could potentially. So the problem is this would, this would require work is like. Like a third kind of currency almost, like a black market currency, where yes, they have to wash, and then they can buy this black market currency off of us. They could wash it into counterfeit. It's basically the only yeah. way I could see that making sense, even though it doesn't yeah, that really actually, make that sense. Yeah, that'd be, that'd be a really good temporary solution where you wash it into counterfeit. So they, like, counterfeit. they give us, so they'll give us their dirty. Then we counterfeit it. And then we give them counterfeit. Minus. Yeah, they take they take like eighty yeah. percent, and then we take twenty percent as clean or something. Hmm. That might. I mean, work. that just seems like a lot of currencies running around. Yeah, exactly. Though. That's my problem with that. That's the issue that I see is then you're fucking your your slash dirty, then your slash counterfeit, uh, counterfeit and then your slash. I don't know, man. Yeah, so like with, the crypt, with the crypto, you could just limit into physical. Also, I want dirty as physical, but here's, here's well, the what crypto. Like the crypto do. is is straight through the bank, right? Well, the so. problem, well, see, what I would think is, I, 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 in my personal opinion, I think that you shouldn't be able to buy crypto that easily. I think it should have to be like hard to get, like through a like through a bank job. You get like a dongle, and then that well, USB that... dongle gives you crypto, an X amount of crypto, or like a random amount, or some BS like that. Well, that's and the thing, right? Yeah. With crypto, it's about where it's at and how that defines how yeah. much it costs, right? So if it's fucking really high, people are paying a lot just for one crypto. 
Yeah, so they, they could make like the prices for crypto. Like they could essentially, if you bought the crypto with Clean and then the tablet, it would be disgustingly expensive to buy items, well, that... or you could get it through like bank job or something. Yeah, like they would have to sell drugs to get dirty, then they'd have to give the dirty to us to get clean, and then they'd have to spend that clean on cryptos, and then they could buy shit off the tablet. Or they could get it from like a bank job where they get like a, a little crypto key that gives them X amount of crypto, you know? That, yeah, we could add something that, like that. That's, right? what, that's what I'm saying. Like, make it easier to get it through a bank, technically, but just make it harder than just buying it straight with clean. Yeah. Otherwise, you're and gonna then, like, people the will, like, just hold on to the tablet until they see cryptos dropped or whatever, and then that's when they're going to want to buy stuff, right? Mm. And I'm assuming that we're probably going to end up <laughs> losing the, um, the tablets at some point to the heist of those tablets, which I'm personally fine with. I don't really care for the black so, market. Uh, the heist what? There's gonna, be, there's gonna be a heist that comes out soonish that gives the, tablets. Uh, so oh, gives and, tablets. Okay. Yeah, and so. But or maybe you really start the hard. heist with the tablet. Oh, that'd be interesting. Well, they were talking about adding more jobs to the tablet, right? Yeah, make make like a job that like it requires you to have a tablet in order to do it. In order to do the job, right? And that would bring more business our way. But again, I'm still I still would rather the wash. See, I what I would like is uh you know talk to the level about this idea these ideas we're brainstorming but i really wanted to pound it in his head to understand that dirty money has no fucking value and the whole idea of the business is that people have to wash it to do anything like i, do, I just don't get why he's so fixated on this idea that if he brings think... in dirty money how is it, it just how do something I think I that his concern is like if we have dirty, then we control that too hard. You know, he wants like an, an alternate exit for dirty, so to speak. So that way, it's not just only through us or bust. But my problem, my my thing around that is, you know, it's not like if we have a bad relationship, we could just say, "Oh, right, we're cutting off your access to dirty," and then they can't watch. They can go through other people that we have decent relations with, sell to them, and then they sell that dirty to us. You know, it's true. But that's, it's, that's the workaround for that. It's just like anything else, though. Like, like they, you, I don't know, man. It's, it should. That's just the way it should be because, like, it's not like we're gonna have bad relations with everyone. If you're selling drugs and doing bank heists and doing other shit that gives you dirty, right? Then yeah, you you can clean it. But like, it's not like that's your only option to make money. You can go be a car dealer or whatever and make clean money right off the hop. But if you choose to do crime, there should be an extra like step to it. And that's going and figuring out who can wash the money for you and having that RP. Like how fucking hard is that for anyone to understand? Not everyone has to rob houses and the people who do should have to wash their fucking money that they sell to a pawn shop. Like there you go. But I, I would definitely, um remember that point that I said, Tony, because if he tries to say, well, we don't want you to have to have full control over Dirty, like, you know, so that way you can't just sell them. They can go around us. They can go to somebody else. Yeah. The other person can go to us. That's that's the important, because we're not going we're gonna to have bad relations with everybody. We've got good relations, and that's the only, the only way for us to make money is to have at least one good relation. Which is Otherwise, why I want don't want to ruin any of our relationships. Exactly. And yeah, like fucking, yeah. Hopefully, I mean, that, level that, can just kind of yeah. like understand In the all car. this stuff. Yeah, I mean, fucking, mm. we're not gonna be like, we're never gonna refuse anybody. We don't like you, so we're not gonna make money off you. Well, I mean, it, it would get to a point where if they like try to hit us while we're trying to like, we're, like they, they call us, say, "Oh, we got dirty," you know, and then. And it's they a try to make a hit on us, and if it and it keeps going like that, then obviously I, I feel like at some point, we, like if the Blues kept doing that to us, then I'd probably be like, oh, well, we're just gonna get stop up there, Luke. Them. Yeah, they'll have to go through somebody you else. Obviously, you know? yeah. If somebody's not actually going through with the deals, we're not gonna make we're deals. Grab bottles them. now, and then we're yeah, making our we way back. We blacklist them until they decide Shit, to pony up and be men about it, and then, but like for the time being, they could go through to somebody else. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like I said, they just have to not make I enemies with everybody. <laughs> I think that was always his biggest worry with the dirty is that it was it, we we're just going to control and then we could just decide who gets money and who doesn't because it's not necessarily yeah he like... thought it was going to be OP as fuck but the thing is is we're still at the bottom exactly and yeah, even with it even with it you know people don't they make money a lot of other ways other than selling drugs exactly 
That's why I'm saying it's not such a big deal if we have that kind of control. Yeah. Because people have the option to not be a criminal. So having the monopoly on dirty actually isn't even that big of a deal. No. I would also like if he's going to move the location and he's actually going to make it like actually workable for us to remove the default tax and let us decide the tax ourselves. I think that's well, the one. We do. We no no no. We do because we can now transfer it from one person to another. So we get to yeah, decide yeah, no, how but, like, much. Yeah, yeah. If I if I want to give somebody like ten percent, you know, and then then you do. I, yeah, 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 but then I go wash it, you know, and it takes a twenty percent. I'm down another ten. But that twenty percent goes right into our boss stash, so we're still getting. Yeah, yeah it. but then I still have to go through. I, I see what you're saying, though. Definitely. Yeah, we're not losing any money. When we wash our money, sense. it's just it's all profit, right? Yeah, I, I thought of it kind of like as people who are doing deals in the family can profit off it while still giving back to the family. You know what oh, I mean? Oh, you mean like if like if they charge thirty percent, they can keep that ten percent kind of thing. Well, what I mean, like, is that if Irish makes a big deal and then he he washes the cash, then we still get a percentage out of it type of thing. Like, if, if we were dealing with huge amounts of money, it could honestly come to that where, like... Yeah, they just keep the 80% and we just yeah. keep the 20 in the boss stash and spend it exactly, on the guns right? and shit later. Yeah, yeah that's kind of what I thought of, like, if it... Mm -hmm. Making huge deals and shit. And that would can, uh, I mean, really we can work. Pay people out at the end of the week and shit like that. Yeah, exactly. Well, we yeah. probably we'd probably have to start keeping track of like who's washing how much or like who's paying out how much. You know. Well, the, it'll be easy because they're gonna they're still gonna have to come to the, one of the three of us to get it yeah. washed. Or T if T ever. Well, so what we see what I heard from T's friend is T like running an excavator and he's like working on his house. Oh. OC. oh. Yeah, that makes sense. So that's why he hasn't been around. So yeah. he'll be he'll be back. I think Kay okay, said she's been pretty sense. busy to it, but she wants to. She's trying to get in, whenever she can. Yeah. I knew like he wasn't gone, gone. I just. Yeah, I always knew he wasn't gone, gone. I was just like, where is he? Like, what's what's he? Hell, what's, what's going on? Honestly, it's I expected during the summer that everybody was gonna be kind of just, you know, wishy washy. So what do you, What do you mean? I don't have a life. <laughs> well, not you. Oh, speaking of which, um. <laughs> If we're doing, so, fight night this week, I'm good for, I leave Saturday and I'll be gone for a week, so next fight night I won't be around, and then the next one after that, assuming that we're still going with the Friday plan, I won't be around for it either. Alright. Basically, I'm probably going to miss three fight nights in a row. I mean, we could make it a different day than a Friday, but I just figured yeah, Friday like was, a, was a good day for it. Yeah, so if we do, like, Wednesdays, then I won't be here. I'll be here for You'll this one. You'll miss one. I'll be here for this one. I'll be missed next one. Here for the one after that, and then miss the one after that, and I'll be this only this two. I'm guaranteed no matter how you want to do this, unless we do it on, like, a Monday. Oh, shit, I was I'm supposed to, to pick up one. Mick. I totally forgot. Who? Yo... Yo, Yo, I got my car up if you're trying to make me meet you somewhere. The new guy? Uh, you know where sulfuric uh, acid is? The guy looks like a Jewish man. Uh, what is it? It's kind of up north on the east side of the map. Looks like a little purple jerry can. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, we're just up there right now. Alright, I'll head that way. Alright. Sorry, I forgot to pick you up, bro. I, I, uh, no, you're good, bro. I, I want right. to like Madam, but at the same time, like she gets on my nerves with a lot of shit that she pulls. Well, she's gonna she's an admin, right? And yeah. I think I think a lot of us have the personality of fighting the hand that feeds. Mm -hmm. I do especially. I just really like Madam because Madam is the one person in staff who loves mafia shit. Yeah. And she's not pretending. She like actually loves this shit. And so that's kind of where it's like I kind of like being a shining example so that when she does spectate us or she is involved in a sit or a scene or whatever you know, it's just like, she's into it, right? Yeah, she you know that she it. understands, you know? Yeah, like, she she likes to see us, she likes to see us interact with the Corleones. Yeah, because, like, the uh, one thing she wanted was for yeah, us to yeah. just figure it the fuck out. And now we are. Yeah, so, like, I was telling her about that, too, when we were having that uh, thing at PD. You know, like, with Johnny and Nate. If we can, if they figure out those wash things. I'll be really interested to see how the mafia thing plays out in Liberty City. Fuck Liberty City, dude. Ooh. I do not want them to come out with that dumbass map, bro. 
That shit is gonna be fucking. You mean flights to the city? Yeah. You don't want flights to the city? Yeah, you guys don't no. want to go back home? Back where our fucking family was slaughtered? Not really. Where your wife is? I'd like That's to go back my home, but Shut not the fuck with up. the rest of the map. <laughs> Where's your, you told me your wife is in Liberty City. No, I told you that she's in an undisclosed location. Oh, I thought you told me Liberty City. Oh, fuck that. She'd be dead by now if she was in Liberty City. <laughs> <laughs> she's in the uh, Van Hymas? She's, like, under witness protection, but it's paid for by me. Gotta keep him safe, you know? The max you can put is like 10 50. or 20. What do we got here? Oh, my bad. That's probably, uh, Mickey. Yeah, it looks like him. Who is that? That's Mickey. He's new. Mickey? Yeah, he's got the oh, Colonel Mickey, Sanders mustache. <laughs> Yo, uh, what up, Colonel Sanders? We're gonna have to have a meeting. We're bringing other dudes and duplicates, so I deleted one, which in turn deleted both of them. So give me your number, please. Oh, yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There you go, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And also, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Just it earlier. Are you okay, Sip? I couldn't find my fire extinguisher. We had this, we had this potentially super awesome situation. What, what was that? So, you remember the hit from yesterday? Right. It turns out the guy just picked a random name out of the hat, essentially. And it just happened to be me. But, um... I got, like, six of our guys, or five other guys from us, to dress up identically to, like... As this, essentially. And we were just like in a circle, like doing that, like hang on to. The... So what were you all put down? Yeah, we did. We, we were all like six of us in a circle like this, and it just looked badass. And we rolled up on the guy, all dressed the same and shit, like scary as hell. And then Nizzy ruined it. Was he like, oh, no, please, no, please, Yeah, he was like, dude, I'm like, I'm so sorry. Like, I have got all these people hunting me down. Like, are you guys like, are you like the leader of them? And I was like, no, but I'm very important. And I'm very well liked in this city, so. He asked Fucking you that? True. Was that before or after? That was, uh, so when we were at HQ afterwards, he called me and apologized. And I told him that I'd, I'd call off the dogs, essentially. Speaking of which, I still got to speak to him. the blonde kid? Williams, yeah, the oh, Sean yeah. Paul. He was just at the... He asked you if you if you were the boss. That's hilarious. Cause yeah, I was just I was like, the boss. when we were there, he, I was like, these are all my boys. So many people after him after that. Oh yeah, outlaws, Which, fucking black widows. To call Corleone's on. God damn, the only two Corleone contacts I have aren't in the city. What do you mean? I saw Jones. I think Vito's in the city. I don't city. have Jones as a contact. I've got Teddy and JJ. What do you want to talk to them about? Uh, to call them up, be like, look, he's fine, he apologized, it was literally over nothing, you can stop hunting him down now. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, I'll call Vito and I don't know, I don't know if they were hunting him down, so to speak, but they were definitely looking out for information for me. Alright, I'll let Vito know. Yo. Yo, Vito, how you doing? Yeah, how you doing? Oh, not too bad. Uh, so, you know the guy that was after Irish yesterday? Yeah. Yeah, that's all settled, so... He's still over there, right? you guys are still looking for him, just don't worry about it. Alright, who was it? Uh, his what name was, was Sean Paul, and... He's still over at the other Apparently, place. he kind of just pulled a name out of a hat, and that's how he picked Irish, I don't know. Is who still at the other so, place? Are you, are you guys still at Hydrochlorine? But, uh, yes, 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 thank yes, you yes, for yes. Yeah. He, he was scared shitless, because he had, like, right everybody in the city First, after him, like so... He came and apologized. 100 on me and, like, We need, uh, we need that's sulfuric good. now. Yeah, just figured I'd let you know, so if you ran into him, you don't fucking bop him or whatever. Yeah, because we, I mean, we were, like, asking to see what was up to try to find it, but... Yeah, it's all good now. Still over there but if it happens right, again, I'll okay. definitely let you know. <laughs> uh, no, he's not. Alright, bro. Alright, have a good one. Okay, you too. I think he just came back. He came out of respect for me and you because 
He likes me a lot. I went to the TV. Where'd you just go? Get to pull over right here. I'm like, okay, sure. Uh, can I? How do you? Yeah, I called Vito. He said uh, <laughs> he'll call off the dogs, but they were still looking for him. <laughs> oh shit, dude! <laughs> I'll tell him I appreciate him and all of his efforts for that. The figure and everything. Personally. I feel super disappointed so that it was surprised. literally nothing. You there was so no sorry. reason for it. Yeah, me too, a little bit. I'm still looking at my phone hoping Jose Keys is gonna fly in one of these days. <laughs> Yeah, so all you gotta do is uh, go up to one of these guys here and just flex your e-muscle, and that'll start filling up those bottles there. Oh, we're cool. I'm gonna head back. I'm pretty full on sulfuric. Alright, see you soon. So is Mick there a new prospect? Yes, sir. Yeah, seems like a nice enough guy. I, I like him a lot. More night guys, or they end up like fucking Nate. He came to us from a recommendation. Well, that's not entirely true. I actually picked him up before he probably got that recommendation because he was like a day old. You don't have a car. We need more nice guys or else they turn out like me. Uh, no, I do not. Alright. We'll make sure to grab you some Scourge of the HQ. Oh, I have a radio, I just don't have comms. Oh, okay. It's uh, 40.3. What was it? 40.3, and then just hit escape. Oh, well. Radio check? Gotcha. Alright, Colt, just gonna make sure. So, what happened with uh, Draco? I heard that he wasn't around. Draco was uh, doing some things he shouldn't have, so he got a permanent flight. Ouch. Yeah, sucks. Such an interesting story with Draco, you know? Just blowing him away and then he joins the group and I don't know. You were doing what to him? Blowing him away, didn't you fucking hear what I said? That's exactly Yo. what I heard. Why did I, I get that when I joined? Uh, yeah. Vinny, comms keep cutting out, bro. Keeps cutting out after you say blow him. Damn, bro. Was it at the nightclub or in the back from the bathroom? No, I'm just saying, like, I blew. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's kind of the reverse way of how bosses do that thing. 
It's not. It's usually like, okay, you want this job? It's not usually, okay, pull down your pants. <laughs> it's like. You mean like, like how you were trying to get promoted, down. Randy? Yeah, honestly. I don't know what, what you're talking about. about, man. We oh, I got clipped, bud. No, 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 no. No, I didn't. I didn't get that. <laughs> uh. Got quite a bit of sulfuric now. Do you want me to start working on hydrochloric? Are you guys working on that? I'm working on hydrochloric stuff? right now. I guess I got bottles. Is Evie alive? Barely. I saw your barber mobile here. I just wanted to make sure. I know this is boring. Yeah, yeah, Ricky, I ditched but, it uh, and joined in with Randy. It's, it's for a good cause, for sure. Do you have a gun, Ricky? Oh, my man's in his head. Okay. Lay low for just a second. I was going like 190 down that street that leads off of HQ, like HQ to the freeway, and a cop pulled out to get me, but I was pretty well gone, so I'm just kind of went down an alleyway. Ten four. Stay quiet. You're just getting too good. Nah, I'm just too fast. This Sultan kind of gets going once you get on a straight. I, uh, I hit 208 on the way here. Oh, wait, no, he doesn't have a soul. No, I don't have a soul. No, I have a fucking elegy. I'm a dumbass. Hey yo, I saw your uh, your ad on the dark web. How, oh, okay, how okay. much are you charging for Dracos? How much you paying? Well, oh, fuck, I don't even know what they go for. Charging like three mil. Three, how much? Three mil. Three mil per. 
Yeah, some guy bought them like five mil off me, but I feel like that's too much. I uh, put them down three. All right, how many you got? Like twelve, probably, maybe ten. Holy shit! Okay. All right, let me think about it. I'll give you a call back. All right, man. All right, bye. Yeesh. Somebody on the dark web is selling Dracos for three mil. <coughs> yeah. That's kind of weird. What? Got some more bottles in the trunk there. The price? Or... <laughs> yeah, they should be about 1.5. Yeah, he says he's got like 10 of them. <coughs> well, then he should be selling them for less. Yeah, no doubt. Fuck, people are so backwards around here, Tony. <laughs> yes, sir. I mean, I wouldn't mind a Draco, but three million dollars. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, that's that's you're asking too much, man. Even if maybe we one point five or like, something. Well, one point five is like the retail price, as far as I know. Um, you can do it on the other side too. That's what I've asked like about. Oh, I thought one point two would be better. Hey, man, it is what it is. <laughs> so what have you been doing in the town up until now? Uh, stunt driver. Which is now completely irrelevant. I can't really make me irrelevant. Because of these stupid ass cameras. The red light cameras? Yeah, yeah. What was your repair bill like? Uh, I didn't really... So I would, uh... I would steal cars, gotcha. AKA given to me by production studio, IAOC Productions. And then I would go perform whatever daring stunts I decided to do at that time. And then when they get pulled over, I would tell them that I was at a part of a stunt crew and that I was getting filmed and that they're fucking up my filming and that it's gonna screw up my contract and yada, yada, yada. But basically I get like a, and then I would do it again. And I'm like, it worked every time, except for when the one time, it was like the fifth time in a row, I think, or the fourth, no, it was the fourth time in a row. And then Chief got out and was like, what the fuck? Why am I, why are you not getting arrested? Because he kept seeing me get pulled over, about the same thing over the radio, I guess. Yeah, I was like, I'm a, I'm a driver, damn it. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'm good on that. Not amazing, though. I'm pretty good. True. Mm -hmm. Uh, well, to be fair, their cars are cracked even before. Even before they were cracked, I would try to get an R8, and then I'd bump into a, like a, a curb that, you know what I mean, didn't hit right, and it just fucks my whole car. Or To be fair, the reason why my cousin got into PD, another reason, is because he got amended and because he was pissed off at the fact that people are suicide ramming his car. So that was like, that's got to change, so which it did. I didn't even... Uh... I've never been to this acid. I've always gone to the other one. Well, this one's like so close to the wash that I've been down here a few times. Yeah, I just realized, like, I wasn't it somewhere else at one point? The wash? No, the this acid? I'm not entirely I don't think sure. So. I never really fucked with the acid before, you know, we really got on it, right? I thought I remember going yeah. to some, like, train station or something at one point. You guys want to talk? 
Rain station. Us two? Yeah, you and boss man. Sure. Sure. Yeah. Holy Here, shit. I'll leave you to hang out with. You're. Oh, he's leaving bottles. Holy shit. Holy shit, Vinny. <laughs> what? <laughs> you just walk right into me. Yeah, no, sorry, I was not looking. The okay, iPad. I know Irish came and kind of talked to you guys already, but let me explain from my perspective. I was very upset because I got punched in the mouth by Mizzy. Yeah. I've never been a real big fan of Mizzy. I've never hated the man. Regardless of what my cousin does or anything like that, I don't give a shit what my cousin does. So that actually pissed me off when he brought him up. Legit. I was very heated with Mizzy, but I wasn't actually going to do any of that shit because then it brings heat upon the family, especially with the cartel, which we have a good relationship with. Alright, so it's just heated the I moment. Just, yeah, 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 I wasn't actually... I've never gone out and just shot people just to shoot people. That's not my style. That's not our family style. That's not what we do. Yeah. So I was just pissed off and venting. Because I was having a good scene. I felt like... We finally we're doing something when I fly in, and every time I fly in the last few times, it's gotten ruined. With the blues, when we we're gonna go clap back on them, we were told to hold off. Then we were gonna gear up the next day. Then it's a cool down. It's like what the fuck? Yeah, it was the same with our family dinner too. It got cut short. Yeah, it just it's it's getting very frustrating, aggravating for me. And then also like, I don't like my cousin being brought up when it's just me. Like, if I'm venting, legitimately it's me. But also, if you didn't know that I wasn't a big fan of Mizzy, then I could understand that. Yeah, I haven't heard you say anything prior, so I just, you know. Well, I, I kind of knew, but I didn't know the extent of it. I heard you, like, kind of mumble about it last time we went and saw Nizzy. But I wasn't too sure what your feelings were on him, like, legitimately. Because, you know, every, he, get, he gets on everyone's nerves, right? Like, yeah, yeah. Mind sometimes. He's right? a wild fucking person, like... <laughs> oh, I wish that you would... By Mila, and I don't know why. I mean, as soon as Irish said, don't be what? a dumbass, I was like, here it comes. Like, immediately. Like, Kinda, what's up? Uh, can you give me, like, ten minutes? Alrighty. I thought we had the same car. Yep, I'm like, oh, cool, good. And then she had just pointed the fucking car. I, I think I'm gonna get fired. Alright. Um, From anyway. the real estate? Yeah. Kanda wants to talk to me at motels. I thought you weren't even allowed to fucking sell houses right now. I'm not, but because uh, I'm not selling as many as others, it might be an issue. But if you can't sell, <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> Well, I wasn't selling that much in the first place. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I mean, I was selling, but I wasn't selling, like, the crazy amount. Yeah, like, some of them get, yeah, they have, like, Nizzy buying, like, 20 fucking places at once off of them. And, yeah, because yeah. Nizzy has a homeboy who's a realtor, and yeah. Yeah, exactly. Everybody uses their homeboy realtor. Yeah. And we're not really in the business of buying locations yet, so it doesn't really help you yeah. out. I mean, we could potentially buy, like, smaller locations, but I haven't really seen anything that caught my eye. There's one house that caught my eye that I want, but... I mean, are you even... Well, it's also an issue when somebody owns, like, 150 properties. Oh, I know, yeah. That's the issue I have, is that people play Monopoly with the properties, and then it's like... You know, where are you supposed to go? None left for anybody else. I, I have some ideas, personally, and I hope that you don't get fired so that we can... You know, like, that would that would be cool. I, I, yeah. I actually wasn't thinking about it for a long time, but now I am. You're not allowed to sell houses right now, right? No, not until we can delete some. Oh, Damn, okay. I was going to be like, I'll give you a sale like, right now. <laughs> yeah, we could go, like, look at, at some point. That, that would work. You could show you these spots so you could tell me if you think that people already live around the area. Remember the one I showed you, yeah. Vinny, down by that weird watery area? That was well, yeah. Whoa, major headache got in here, either of you. Are we about to crash because you guys are cutting in and out bad?
Yep, I'm about to crash. Fucking knew it. Was there like a server restart? Like, what's going on here? Don't understand. Yeah, yeah, Papa, we hot like a sauna. I'm getting that money, I'm moving all sturdy. I can't be fucked with no drama. Leveled up now, dripping the Zana. You can't be telling me nada. Yeah, yeah, Chris Papa, we hot like a sauna. I'm getting that money, I'm moving all sturdy. I can't be fucked with no drama. Leveled up now, jumping designer. You can't be telling me nada. Shot a little baddie, she got a fatty. I be like, oh, more the amas. I be like, oh, more the amas. Papa, we hot like a sauna. I'm getting that money, I'm moving all sturdy. I can't be fucked with no drama. Leveled up now, jumping designer. You can't be telling me nada. Shot a little baddie, she got a fatty. I be like, oh, more the amas. I be like, oh, more the amas. How many bottles you got on you? I've got 54. I can help you out if the rest of the guys get here if you want. Yeah, my bad. I turned shout on to yell at you guys earlier when you guys were when Vinny was sitting there. Yeah. And uh <laughs> you guys having your secret meeting and I'm over here talking to to say what was it what's his name? Sip. Sip, yeah, I'm over here talking to him to like fucking screaming my head off. I was like, ooh, so I just noticed that Oh yeah. 
Um, can I get your Discordia? Yeah, I'm Lelouch on uh, Familia RP. Lelouch7164, I believe. Oh, it didn't do it. Hold on. Maybe just... Oh, okay. Here's one. It's got a suit. You'll be quite impressed, I assure you. He's quite the Russo himself. Is this guy with you? Which guy? Where? The guy in this purple car. Uh, that looks like Sip's car. Let's see. Why do you look different? You look so different? Uh... What the fuck? I don't know, you just, earlier, you ran across, you looked different. I, like, pulled my gun out, I'm like, who was good? Who is this? <laughs> oh, yeah. Spooky, I guess. That yeah, was weird, because, like, shadows had, like, a pad or some shit. I'm like, what's, it looked like yeah. a black dude with, like, a fucking bandana on? I'm like, what's, what? What's happening? I think it's like that sometimes, especially, like, when a bunch of people are kind of flying in all at the same time, the server's like, yeah. what's happening? What's For sure. I'm sure I've seen that. Yo, Mickey, you want to just say something in the uh, Discordia and then I'll just find you that way? Oops, some people are crashing again. Thanks, man. Again.
Can I? Is there a way I can take this and and send an invite to it? To find his. Weird noise.
Yeah, yeah. Papa, we have like a sauna. I'm getting that money, I'm moving all sturdy. I can't be fucked with no drama. Leveled up, now dripping the Zana. You can't be telling me nada. Yeah, yeah. Papa, we have like a sauna. I'm getting that money, I'm moving all sturdy. I can't be fucked with no drama. Leveled up, now dripping the Zana. You can't be telling me nada. Shot a little baddie, she got a fatty. I be like, I'm all the amas. I be like, I'm all the amas. Papa, we have like a sauna. I'm getting that money, I'm moving all sturdy. I can't be fucked with no drama. Leveled up, now dripping the Zana. You can't be. Yikes.
It's all good, bro. <laughs> I don't, like, it wasn't even that, really. I think it was more of the fact that everybody was kind of bummed out that that the guy was, like, we wanted to kill that guy. <laughs> we didn't want him to apologize and shit like that, but I don't even know, whatever. It is what it is. I'm not worried about it. The server back up, like this shit's. Are people getting their I'm are people getting their characters deleted and shit? Like, I was kind of looking at the fucking chat here, and it's like, a couple people mentioned losing their characters. Isn't Max one of your boys? Did you lose a character. One of my peeps made calzones. Damn, that makes me hungry. I want a fucking calzone. Oh, it's working. It's working. Come on. Don't delete my character. That would fucking suck. Whoa! Knocked over my bong. That's not good. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. Papa, we have like a sauna. I'm getting that money. I'm moving all sturdy. I can't be fucked with no drama. drama. Leveled up now, dripping the Zana. You can't be telling me nada. Yeah, I yeah. Love Chris Fresh. Oh, we have like a sauna. I'm getting that money, I'm moving all sturdy. I can't be fucked with no drama. Leveled up now, dripping the Zana. You can't be telling me nada. Shot little baddie, she got a fatty. I be like, I'm the Yamas. I be like, I'm the Yamas. I don't know how much oh, we have like a sauna. I'm supposed to get I'm on the money, I'm moving all sturdy. I can't here. be fucked with no drama. At some point. Leveled up now, dripping the Zana. You can't be telling me nada. Shot little baddie, she got a fatty. I be like, I'm the Yamas. I be like I'm the Yamas. Hey, I'll be dripping in the Zana, walking the party as she fell. Hopefully we can get that worked out, cause it's never really worked. Been having to make money like every other way, <laughs> but we're pretty good at it. It's not power gaming if that is right, you know? What's up, Sippy Poo? Hey. Tony's here. What up, Tony? Everyone's looking for you. They're panicking. What do you mean? I wasn't in the city. I just blew it. Come on, face. They're panicking without you. Ah. We're leaderless. Shit. We have no direction in life. Oh, no. Better run around in circles. Put you... Put your hands up like this, and then just run around like this. That's what I was doing. Ooh, there's no boss! There's no boss! <laughs> it's okay. I'm here now. So, put that Thank stuff God. in that bottle. Good job. Good Thank job. Thank you. Yeah, I need to be micromanaged. Before, I was just sticking my finger in the bottle. I didn't know what to do. And then just snorting the acid and shit. Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. Just get a whiff. <laughs> My finger doesn't feel so good. Yeah, I bet. What is this, sulfuric? Yeah, I think, yeah. How, how are your head? At least you got gloves on. That's smart. You know what you're yeah. doing. I got one one fingerless one. Oh, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Not too now. Oh, yeah, it's all burned off. Fuck. Damn. I think they were looking to start doing the math now that I think we have over 400 of each now. Nice, nice. Oh, shit. Uh, yeah, that's really good. It's my assault in there if you want to take off. I think most people are hanging around HQ. 
You good? You picking up stuff? Hey, you didn't see that stuff on the ground? Yay, my face looks good. 